Hi, I'm Matt, and in this quick video tutorial, we're going to be adding a newsletter sign-up box to our Magento website. And this question came in from Nick in the forums. Hello, can I move the position of the newsletter sign-up box, and could I put the code into a static block so that I can place it underneath my products, for example? Regards, Nick. So the way to do this is actually really straightforward. And if you can manage copy and paste, then you can do this on your Magento website as well. So down here at the bottom in the reply, and again, I'll put the link and the code for you underneath this video tutorial. And it's really just a case of straightforward copy and paste. And as you know, I understand an EB like copy and paste easy. So let's go and copy that code so we can see we've got block type newsletter forward slash subscribe and then the template. Now, it's worth noting that you do have the template file in here. So if you are using a child theme for Magento, then you can customize these options even further if you wish to. We're not gonna cover that in the tutorial, we're just gonna keep it copy and paste easy for you. So let's right click and copy that code. And let's go across to our Magento website right now. And on our Magento website, we're using the Ultimo theme from Theme Forest, and it costs like $99, around £60. And what I'm going to be doing is adding this newsletter sign-up box down here in this white section underneath the image gallery. Now, to do that, we need to go and add this code to a static block within Magento. So I've come into CMS, then into Static Blocks, and I know the block which we're after is the block underscore image underscore bottom and we need to click into that one number one enable it and number two just go and copy and paste this code in there so let's change the status from disabled to enabled delete what we've got in there already right click and then paste our code in and then press save block at the top now that was pretty straightforward now if we go across to our magenta website and then pick a product and then go and refresh the product what you'll now see is underneath your image gallery and again this could have been any other static block on your Magento website you've now got the newsletter sign up box where a customer can then subscribe they can enter their email address click on subscribe and they'll then be added to your Magento newsletter list so for myself Matt hope you enjoyed this video tutorial and cheerios we both hope that you found this video tutorial useful if you have then subscribe to be kept up to date with more Magento themed tutorials. Back before myself and Matt started building Understanding E, I was under the impression that Magento was really nerdy and that you almost needed to be a developer to get the most out of it. And now, I know that that just doesn't have to be the case. That's why we built Understanding E, to show you that Magento is really easy to use and you can use it for your business to sell onto eBay and Amazon, and most importantly, that a degree in nerd is not required. If you would like to find out more about us and gain access to over 150 non-nerd step-by-step video tutorials on Magento, then please visit us at understandinge.com. And we'll see you there. Cheerios.